Hello, friends! Today, I'm going to explain how to aim your weapons in Battle Bay. This is a crucial skill to have, and I know many players don't fully understand how aiming works. Starting off with the basics, your weapon will aim towards the center of your view and automatically stick to your enemies. Turn your view by swiping anywhere on the screen that isn't one of the main controls. Your weapon will always try to turn towards where you are looking, but it takes a while for your weapon to turn. The speed at which your weapon turns is affected by the turret agility stat. Once your weapon has recognized an opponent and the target cursor has selected them, you can press the target lock button to keep your aim on them. Now, let's move on to a more advanced aiming topic that I know a lot of beginners struggle with or just don't realize that you can do in Battle Bay, and that is to lead your target. Leading your target is basically to shoot ahead of a moving target so that the target and the projectile will collide. It is necessary when your target will have moved significantly from the moment you shoot to the moment your projectile should reach your target. Many of the weapons in Battle Bay have projectile speeds that are not fast enough to hit a moving target from a distance and need to be shot in the direction the target is moving. Let's begin with a look at the regular cannon. To lead your target, you first need to get your cannon focused on your enemy. Once your weapon sticks to your target, hold down the aim button so that you can manually control the aim. Then, very slightly move the target in the direction their ship is going and release to fire your cannon. If you did things right, your enemy will move right into your shot and take damage. Here are a few more examples of leading your target. This concept is the same with mortars and torpedoes. You first get your weapon focused on your target, then manually aim it ahead of your target so that when your shot is traveling to the target, it lands right on top of them. The distance ahead of your enemy that you must aim will depend on the weapon's projectile speed and how far away the enemy is. When you click on any of the cannons or torpedoes, you can see its projectile speed under its list of stats. Higher projectile speeds won't require you to aim very far ahead, while slower projectile speeds require you to aim significantly further ahead of your target. The sniper has a very high projectile speed, which means you usually won't need to lead your target. This is why the sniper feels like a very easy to use weapon for beginners. On the other hand, torpedoes all have very low projectile speeds, so you either need to get a lot closer to your enemy, or aim the target far ahead of where they are going. You can increase your projectile speed through item perks and talents from your crew. The one last thing I want to talk about is the options in your game settings that can change the way your ships aim and interact with your enemies. The rotate camera with ship option turns your view in the direction of your ship's rotation. This means when you rotate your ship to the right or left, your aim will follow in the same direction. The sticky targets option makes it harder for your weapon to lose its focus on a specific enemy. Although the use of these features is up to you and your playstyle, I personally recommend keeping them both off as it can give you greater control of your ship. I hope this video has helped you with your aim and remember to spend some time practicing with your favorite weapon. Once you get the hang of a weapon's speed, it becomes a lot easier to hit a moving target from a distance. If you have any further questions, leave a comment below and I will try my best to answer. As always, if you like this video, please leave a like and subscribe for more Battle Bay content. Bye friends!